Hey guys, it's Joshua Stern with Keller Williams Real Estate. Today's blog is about the top 10 home repair and maintenance tips every Utah homeowner needs to know. So my goal with this is to keep you educated about all things real estate so you have the ability to make great decisions when it comes time to own your own home or sell your own home. So today, again, easy home maintenance and repair tips. Number one on the list, the furnace filter. So locate and change your furnace filter every three months to extend the life of the furnace while at the same time increasing the efficiency of the furnace so it stays hot in the winter and cool in the summer. Number two, leaky faucets. It's super easy to go to a Home Depot or a Lowe's to buy the repair items that are necessary to keep your faucets from leaking. You'll be surprised at how fixing this could actually lower your water bill at the same time stop the annoying water torture sounds of ever-present dripping. Number three, understand the basics of unstopping clogged drains. I would say pour a cup of white vinegar down shower drains and sink drains once a week to help prevent clogs and unwanted smells of rotting debris in the drain system. Number four, know the location and the operation of the electric panel. It's super helpful to label the circuit breakers to know what breaker operates what circuit line. It's important to know how to reset a tripped circuit breaker and if you need help with that, I recommend calling an electrician. Number five, fixing the squeaky door. So there are a couple of easy ways to handle this. You can spray WD-40 on the hinges or you can pop the hinges off, add a little bit of Vaseline and this will last you a couple of years. Number six, here are a couple of things all homeowners need to know. A, the location of your water shutoff valve inside of the house as well as the water shutoff valve along the street and know how to operate both of them. B, understand how drainage works around your foundation. So if you put, put a soccer ball near the foundation and the ball rolls toward the foundation, then you need to understand that water will run into your foundation and could cause moisture problems like mold, mildew, or worse, it could actually begin cracking the foundation of your home. If the ball rolls away from the foundation, you're in great shape. Make sure your water heater safety valve is working properly. The last thing you want is a water heater blowing up in your home. The pressure valve, which is on the top of the heater, you can pop this up and it will drain the line from outside of the house into a visible location. If you see water coming out of the drain, that means the pop-out valve may have failed and may need to be replaced. And finally, one home repair tip to trump them all, and that is caulking. So exterior caulking breaks down after a couple of years. The caulking around the uh, windows and the doors to the exterior will actually keep air from entering inside of the home. Inside, you wanna focus around tiled areas, windows, bathrooms, showers, tubs, countertops, sinks. This prevents moisture from getting inside unwanted area. So water can de uh, deteriorate and damage behind counters, walls, the floor, etc. Regular maintenance of fresh caulking will prevent long-term and expensive damage. And let's face it, caulking is fun. Thanks again for watching the video blog.